Imagine you can go for training while working at the best of all. Ah. You get extra money. This can actually be possible. Here's everything you need to know about skills upgrading in Singapore. Summarize and simplify for you. Turn on the CC if you don't understand my essence. So, so, ah, so, by now, ah, you should know that everything ah, can be replaced. Ah. Who do you think write this script? <laughs> This is why we all need to upskill no matter how young or old we are. If not, uh, you might be totally displaced in a few years here. Uh. Deputy Secretary General of NTUC Desmond Tan said that he wants to collaborate with more companies by forming company training committees and urge employers to empower workers to attend training. NTUC Every Worker Matters Conversation Key Findings review that workers across all age groups recognize the importance of upskilling for career development. He also agreed that training is a meaningful use of time to develop their skills and better career progression or earn higher wages. But here's the thing, oh, here's the thing. How can we upskill when we don't even have the time to work? Stop spending 2 hours on TikTok everyday and you have an extra day per week. But oh, seriously, uh, this is a problem that's hard to solve unless you are incentivized to do it. Cause let's face it, oh, let's face it, you give me money to upskill. Of course I'll upskill. You see, uh, the good idea is that as workers upskill and transform, uh, the company will also upskill and transform. This benefits the workers and the companies. That is of course good, uh, but it can be gooder. Eh. Currently, uh, there are grants for companies to have CTCs. Uh, but just imagine this, uh, just imagine this. What if we also give allowance for workers who went to upskill? And what if we also give time off for workers who went to upskill? Especially those who did self-initiated training. Yeah, these are the suggestions that NTUC proposed to employers. I confirm will go well since I can avoid staying home to hear my wife. FBI, open up! I confirm will go well since I earn more money so that I can buy more food for my wife. NTUC also got suggestions for the government, like providing training allowance for acquisition of deep skill sets, expanding subsidies for workers to pursue a second degree or diploma, and advocating short-term unemployment support for involuntary displaced workers. So basically, uh, the whole idea is that for CTC to work super well, we need help from everyone, from workers to employers to government. During the inaugural Company Training Committee Symposium, NTUC Secretary General Ng Chi Min said that through CTCs, we enable employers to enjoy increased productivity and better business outcomes, while workers benefit from improved wages, welfare, and work prospects in a sustainable manner. Yeah, so the system is now in place. Huh? Now we need to improve the system. If not, something went wrong. If this issue persists, please, you won't want to be replaced with USD $20, right?